This is why your house looks so poor. Today, we're talking about how to elevate your home. The idea behind real estate is to make your home look more expensive than what you bought it for. So if you're thinking of selling your home or if you just want to elevate your home, take these tips into consideration. Tip one, get rid of clutter. You want to buy furniture that has built-in storage and then you want to place them in high traffic zones like your entryway, bedside table, and desk. Baskets with lids are another great way to hide all the things you don't want people to see. Tip two, dress up your coffee and dining room tables. If they're completely empty or they're covered in crap, you're missing an opportunity to display some beautiful objects and really elevate the room. For your coffee table, you want to get a beautiful decorative box to hide your remotes and then pair that with things that are meaningful to you. For the dining room table, I would get maybe a large vase or bowl. In my opinion, the bigger, the better. You want to make sure your comforter, sheets, and pillow are plush and clean. If you want your pillows to look extra luxe, you can actually double stuff the pillowcases for double the plushness. Tip four, add more lighting. We often don't put enough lighting in our spaces. You want to think about lighting every single corner and how the light's going to bounce off the entire space. Adding more lighting changes the entire ambiance and mood of a space, and it's not expensive. You can easily transform it, and it takes the cheap out of the room. Tip five, update your art. Art is hard because it's so personal. However, if you have a cheap frame or a cheap print, you immediately devalue your house. Especially if you're selling your home, you want to depersonalize the space as much as possible. You can really improve the space by using good visual composition. You want your home to look like an art gallery. Unfortunately, your wedding photos are not art. Tip six, add floral or greenery to your space. Studio McPhee actually has really great inexpensive fake plants. Or if you're lucky enough to have outdoor space, go out, trim some twigs, shove them in a vase, because stems are all the rage right now. Overall, I'm a huge proponent of investing in your home and making it feel as elevated as possible. This has been Getting Housed with Paul. Cheers.